Printing today is done by a totally different process. You know what it is? You know what it's called? You don't. It's called, let it, it's called offset printing because the process is totally different. So we, we set our work and we compose it up into forms such as that one there where I've set a heading and the heading is in separate letters. I've put a border around it, there's the border and the type here has been set on the liner type and there it is ready for printing, composed. So, yeah, right on. So when it's time to come, we can lock that up in a form. Now Ian at the moment is running a job and he stopped running it when I told him new people were coming. So you'll be able to see it actually being printed before you go. Alright, so to do all the setting we have to use these old machines. Now, after this they invented photo typesetters. And then after photo typesetters came computers. And that's how it's all prepared today. But this is the liner type where we still set in lead. So what's your name? Emma. What is it? Emma. Emma. E-double-M-A. -M Now see if you can read this, Emma. Don't touch it, it's hot. Emma was a visitor. <laughs> now that's still pretty warm, but you can pick it up if you like. Just remember, it's still pretty hot. You want to try it? No, I won't pick it up. <laughs> Someone else want to try it? Now the lead that we're using is in this metal pot in the back here. That bar is melting down, yeah. and the metal in there is at 520 degrees molten lead. Mm -hmm. so Where's I? Cast the line. It's going to go through the machine and out within 11 seconds. That's pretty good. That'll be a solid. Well, it's still hot, but solid. Yeah. So. Um, so I've just set there for you guys. Now is the time for all good men to come. Alright? When I'm setting, I'm bringing down brass mats like that. And you can read the word on there? Got it? Come. On the other side, those letters are embedded in the brass. To make up the word. Yep. And the lead is going to be forced into the top line to cast the characters on the slope. The bottom line is exactly the same, only it's italic. So I can set the line normal type or I cut it. In this case it's just normal. It's gone in, you'll see the plunge has gone down, it's gone down and finished. And I'll stop the machine and there's the line in the mould exactly as all the words on there. The mats are still sitting in here, all the brass mats that make up that type. They're going to come to the top here and the other elevator at the top is coming down where so they'll transfer over so that they can go back up to the top as that and get distributed back into the magazine. Oh. You hear the mats all falling back where they came from? Yeah. I damage the end that damage the end level there. Now is the time for all good men to come. Yeah. That's still too hard. Yeah, so the liner type was invented, as I say, back in 1886. Came into the printing industry around about 1893. 
and was used right up from the mid 1970s for doing all your newspapers, all your job printing. There's a newspaper page I've set in lead. That's what it looks like, prior to printing. And that was done for every page and every daily paper. Years.